Oh, yeah, no women are special. So no woman is special, but yet you guys have a whole podcast dedicated how to get women. Just for sex. Say you swear to God. Brady, is push your pee! She push your pee! What's good, YouTube? It's your guy, King Viral Say. And today we're about to get into another video. <sighs> I didn't want to do this, I. Right? I'm not gonna to talk too much because I'm trying to get straight to the video, but I heard Brittany Renner just body the shit out of the Fresh and Fit podcast. I don't wanna believe this, but if it's true, these these are gonna be very tough times, bro. So with that being said, let's get into it. Fresh great idea was don't tell Myra until today. <laughs> so we walk in, you first see Brittany Renner. Uh -huh. I ain't gonna lie, before you even say anything, Brittany, I ain't gonna lie, I'm saying. <laughs> you said you said initially like yeah, I don't think there's much to really like debate. Why? Well, I mean, <laughs> we here's the thing. We've oh, always no. said like men and women were very different. We have opposing goals. Like girls True. are trying to you know get resources, time, attention out of guys. Guys are trying to get sex. True. And, Girls, a lot of the time, are trying to get what they need to get. Nah, but Brittany, Brittany, like, Brittany knows it's true. Some girls are good at it, some girls aren't. And then there's other girls that are kind of models for that, that are good at finessing dudes. And not to say that you're a finesser, I ain't saying that, but... Bro, Brittany knows it's true. <laughs> she knows it's true. She laughing about it, bro. She does. She's like, oh, damn, this nigga leaking that shit. It's true, bro. Females can have sex anytime they want. Guys can only have sex with a female by chance. Females carry more leverage when it comes to sex than we guys do. Like, they can literally flex their pussy out, and niggas gonna fuck. If a nigga flex his dick out, a female's gonna block or follow, leave him on scene open, all that shit, bro. Because she wants more than just dick from a nigga. That's how females operate. Well, most females, as far as I'm concerned. I'm laughing on a lot of guys, and that's why our podcast exists, to help dudes out to understand, like, how women operate and how they move. Now, it's you true. Know, point of view. Wait, 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 where do you think she fits in that... Because, you know, I, I think her point of view would be diametrically opposed to you guys might say, well, well, I'm not the, the exact typical person who you may think dudes are running into or you're trying to tell me what's their way. Wait, wait, so we're asking about Brittany? I mean, well, sure, she could tell. She was saying that we're wrong, I guess, about that. Well, so I you want, tell us a little oh, bit she, about she, she, No, she I think you know more about me than I do myself. So you're oh, saying... No, no obviously, no, obviously you do, though. Oh, you said that you warn oh, guys about girls like me, so tell me about girls like me. Just you women me. in general. Like, I mean, well, no, but no, don't women in general, because you literally... I was about to say something, bro. I'm not, I, I feel like I'm talking okay, to you. Yeah, you did say that you warn guys about girls like me. So now that we're face-to-face, -face, what kind of girl am I? You're not special. You're like other girls. That's I'm not special. Like, so, like oh, other women that are so what makes you special then? Oh, shit. This is actually getting... I ain't gonna lie, Brittany. Listen, Brittany, let's be real here. Brittany finessed how many niggas, man? Am I on the camera? There we go. Brittany finessed how many niggas? She, bro... Bro, it, come on, like, let's be real, she, like, bro, she, she, she fuck niggas, and she gets shit off of niggas, bro. Like, and I know a lot of females gonna be on my shit and to be hating on me and say, you don't know Britney, fuck you, blah, blah, blah. Listen, I'm down for the game to cancel, baby. Listen, I don't have Twitter or TikTok. Cancel me! Cancel me! Please cancel me! I never said I was. But you're trying to say, well, what makes me different from, like, a lot of women operate the way you do. Which and, is, and that's true, though. In general, what I just said before, women, it's a dance between the two genders. Men are trying to get sex. Women are trying to get resources, time, attention, whatever it is that they're looking for. And a lot of girls play the game better than guys. We talk and about that's true, bro. And we're teaching guys how to not necessarily get finesse and get what they want out of girls, which a lot of the times is intimacy, but they're not able to get it. But girls are easily able to obtain money, time, resource, attention, whatever it is. Girls are running laps around this, which yeah. is why podcasts like ours exist. Future words. He's a word. He's a he's a disciple of future. Mm -hmm. Extracted as you say, time, resources, and other things out of dudes. Tough. Yeah, to a degree, sure. Yeah, I mean, like a lot of girls want to do. I mean, it, well, here's the thing. You've been so adamant about me being incorrect, and I, I I don't know, and you don't know me, and all that stuff. Tell me then. Maybe maybe we're off. Who knows? Oh. Well, I think. Okay. First of all, let's. Bring it back a couple notches. Mm -hmm. Period. Okay. That's how you bitches so, be talking. There's really a lot to unpack here because my first question to Listen. you is, 
What do you gain from telling girls that they're not special? How does that make you feel? I mean, I know everything... a real question so how does it make you feel because if i say you're a bitch ass nigga oh shit make... whoa 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 i thought this was a podcast this is not a this is a this is a roast she coming crazy on my mans i mean she called me a bitch ass nigga best believe i'm gonna start barking i'm like rah, rah, rah. <laughs> psych nigga for me right if i insult you or if i tell you you're not special you're forgettable oh what does that do for me? No, but that doesn't, but that's what I'm saying. No, but I'm, but I'm saying, what, if I call you, if I just say that, again, you're forgettable. That's why I didn't want to do you guys' podcast. Forgettable. Hate the setup. Uh, the name is underwhelming. I didn't really see the value in it. Yikes. Are you a podcaster? You should check out Riverside FM. It's your new online That's podcast. so cool. Woo! All right, Brittany. Now, Brittany, Brittany, Brittany just, Brittany's coming for blood. Right? That's Brittany's coming right. for blood. But, so that's fine but for me that's okay if it wasn't a fit for me but i also don't need to you know in a way kind of try to devalue what you guys have going on because at the end of the day i might not agree with anything you guys talk about because honestly i feel like when you've seen two or three videos you've seen them all right but the reality is is that i went to your guys's page and i went to the different links and the different services and the courses that you guys offer and i do see that there's a place for that okay so okay. even though it may not have been in alignment with what i am about i can still give credit where it's due without trying to devalue you guys because you guys are doing something what the fuck this girl smart as hell right yo Brittany, are, I mean, you is every are there a lot of people doing what you do yeah. you could consider your guys's podcast special right i think what she's mentioned is like the self self did, did she just, did she just, did I just, I think I agree with Brittany. I think I agree with Brittany, bro, what the, f that, that was, Brittany, I ain't gonna lie, you said some real ass shit, I ain't gonna lie, you said some smart ass shit, like, not, not even trying to be a sort of cassock or anything, I'm trying to listen, I'm trying to be on Fresh and Fit t team, but, Brittany, what the fuck, good point, good point. Either attract or, or, you know, try to talk to women and, and really engage with them at a higher rate that you could, you know, potentially date them, right? Right. Yeah. Yeah. I, 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 guess, I guess the point that I think she's disagreeing with, right? When... I was simply asking her to tell us about herself because we were so incorrect. So tell us about yourself. That's all I'm saying. And then she well, went into attacking us. And no, no one's attacking you because, like I said, I never listen. There's a lot of people that will not sit down and have a conversation with you just because of the comments that you guys made. Well, you made, and well, you chimed in. So you guys are tweedling and tweedled down, kind of right. So I'm oh, to have a conversation with you guys. Oh because shit! Because for me, I feel like what a lot of male-dominated podcasts are missing is the bridge of understanding. So I came here not to argue you guys or to call you out of your name or to disrespect what anybody's doing because I, I felt like the interview I had with him there were things that he said I didn't agree with but right. I wanted to sit down and hear his point of view right. so that's what I'm trying to do here so right. for you to say you're not special well I'm special to someone just like you're special to someone just like he's special to someone so for you trying to generalize all groups of women then we would have to take it back to where this even began like why you even have this view of women and every like I said you have a bunch of Dumbass bitches on your guys' podcast, and I get it, they don't challenge you. Yo. And I know you're a really smart guy, but it's like, I feel like you need to kind of just be honest and show people who you really are. Brittany's pushing P! Brittany's pushing P, bro. The, for those who don't know, that nigga Myra, the, the nigga with the, the, the bald headed nigga, well, he's not bald, but you know what I mean, bro. This nigga body 10 females, all right? 10 females, 10 on one type shit. Myron Cole is fuck. He will body the shit out of you with facts, all right? Literally the shit that he says, bro, I always agree. I had to agree with him. But Britney, Britney's coming off crazy. Britney just, Britney said, Hezzy, pull back, foul, and one. Bro, Britney is really pushing P, bro. I ain't gonna lie. I'm, I'm low-key siding with Britney now. Like, what the fuck, bro? This girl really spit I thought all she know what to do is to just suck dick and finesse niggas. I thought that's what who Britney is. She wrote a book about it. She wrote a book about it. She tried my nigga PJ. Free my nigga PJ. 
Myron, 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 you better come up with some shit because he is literally botting the shit out of you, my boy. And then the, the, the other nigga just quiet as hell. Like, what? I know that for people to be dragging you guys and say, take this little clip and say that's who you are, that's not true. So that's why I sat down and had this conversation. I'm not here to, to degrade you. So when you make comments, let me say, but I'm saying when you make comments like, oh yeah, no women are special. So no woman is special, but yet you guys have a whole podcast dedicated how to get women. Just for sex. Say you swear to God, Brady is push your pee! She push your pee! I've underestimated Brittany. Brittany, I'm not gonna lie. I'll fuck the shit out of you, no cap. But I, I thought all, I did not expect her to be this intellectual, bro. Like the shit that she's saying is low key facts. Like, and and Myra's Myra's not even saying nothing. This nigga's speechless. Like, bro, Brittany, bro. And she's not even try, bro. Some, bro. She's carrying y'all females. I. Britney is literally carry off females. When you think of whores, you think of Tiana Trump or Britney Renner. Britney Renner's a dot, slut, whore, gold digger bitch, whatever case may be, whatever y'all want to label her. And yet she's still spinning fat. Why she sound like she a, she a Yale University student with a 4.1 GPA? I guess, like, bro, not only does she give brains, she has one too. Britney, you goaded. I ain't gonna lie. That's all you guys are. So you're saying men are just limited to just sex. That's all they care about is sex. Oh my God, yes, bro. What the fuck? Bro, bro, bro. Brittany, Brittany up by five. Brittany had a 10-0 run. Brittany had a 10-0 run. She's just bodying niggas, bro. She, she having, she just scoring on niggas, bro. Myri, your defense. That's all you guys care about. There's no emotional need. It's just my dick, come sex, I want a hole. Wow, you are triggered, man. Wow. Nah, Myron, 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 she's spitting facts, bro. She's spitting facts, bro. I'm not gonna lie. Brittany is spitting facts. And I'm not even trying to side with this girl, bro. I'm Listen, I'm gonna still support Fresh and Fit Podcast before, during, and after this video. But what the fuck, bro? This nigga body 10 females, but he can't body this girl. Heck, there's three niggas here. Two of these niggas on the same team. This nigga quiet as shit. And then this nigga is a speechless as fuck. And Brittany just, she's still going. She didn't even pull out no statistical facts or nothing. She's just saying shit how it is. Shit, she got my dick scared. I ain't gonna lie. What the fuck? Honestly, it's just I speak with conviction. Yeah, I mean, for you to say girls like me, I'm just like, okay, well, I'm assuming if I go off of what people have said about me, I'm a gold digger who finessed my boyfriend who I lived with and wanted to marry me and still wants to have, would want to have more kids with me if I wanted to stay with him. BJ. I finessed him. And Is that true? I guess I'm a gold digger. And so all, all girls right, like Let's bring this back full circle because you're speaking with a lot of emotion right now. And to be honest, you're not really making a point. I said, my room. Time. Oh, no, man. Women, man. It's a delicate dance between the two genders to get what they want. Correct? I said, men want sex, women want resources, attention, uh, money, time, whatever it is from men. It, it changes per girl. Some girls want money, some girls want attention, some girls want time, well, some girls want a hot guy, whatever it is. But there's a multivariate okay. requirement from women of what they want. Men, men typically, it's just sex. So, True. in that regards of intersexual dynamics between men and women, I'm saying you're not special because you're like every other girl. You want to get resource time attention or whatever it may be commitment okay. from a man and a man wants to get sex from you okay so when it comes to that we're talking about biology of what men want from women you are not special you are just like every other girl just like i'm every other guy the difference is this i'm not going to sit here and say i'm special i'm Aaron Gaines. i can do this and that we 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 we, <laughs> we said all the time city boys up but like we don't sit here and try to make ourselves look special we're regular guys we want sex it is what it is. But women run around and say, I'm special. I'm, I'm different. Oh, no, 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 no. It's like, nah, bro. Y'all don't live in reality a lot of times. You guys say, I deserve that. I deserve this. I'm special. So okay, I'm special. Myron. Like, okay, Myron. At the end of the day, you're a woman. I'm a guy. You are playing the game to get what you want out of the relationship. I'm playing the game to get what I want out of the relationship or temporary relationship, whatever it is. So I'm not going to sit okay. here and say I'm special. That's what I'm talking about. You can say you're special in other regards, but I'm talking about between men and women, that is the game. 
That's how it is. My job. Okay, Myron made a point. Okay, Myron made a point. I'm not gonna hold you. God damn advertisement. Oh, it's over. All right, that was like part one of the video. Apparently, this is a part two. Uh, if y'all want me to react to that, I will. I might do that later or tonight. I don't know. It depends on my mood because I got to go hoop later. This is absolutely crazy, bro. Brittany, Brittany, you said some real shit. I ain't going to lie. You're making the city girls look good. I ain't going to hold you. Because all these other females that Myra put on his podcast, some of them are celebrities, some of them are OnlyFans, some of them are models, whatever the case may be. Myra destroyed them all. He's Thanos. Nigga. Snapped his finger. But Britney is a worthy opponent to Myron. I'm not going to hold you. She, she low-key bodied this nigga. She was spitting some real ass shit. I'm not going to lie. Like, as much as I want to support Myron, which I will keep supporting him because this nigga gave me a view of how I... A different view of how I view women because women treated me bad and all that shit. But... Britney, bro, what the fuck? She was saying some real shit. Now, listen, props to Britney. I, I had to give, I had to give her props, bro. She, cause she was saying some, some real shit too, bro. Because all these other bitches in his podcast, they, they couldn't even step up to him. And there was like an army of them. He still bodied all of them. So, uh, anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys do, please make sure you like, share, subscribe. I will try to react to part two after I come back from LA Fitness. So with that being said, it's your guy King Brown Sai. Logging out. I'm going to do that Brittany.